It's uh, currently 7.17 in the morning. Uh, I wasn't going to do a vlog of the of this trip with me and Barty, but I thought, oh, we might as well because nothing else is happening. Um, it is the Dawnbreaker Big Blue Snapper Cup day, so we're out. Uh, we're out again for another fish. Just came back from uh, up north from my marlin and trout fishing expedition. We launched at about 4:15, and uh, pretty much I've been uh, in the front of the cabin asleep, curled up in a ball since then. Barty hooked a little hammerhead, which is pretty cool. Okay. And then he just dropped, uh, probably was a really good snapper actually. Uh, it's pretty horrible at the moment, we've got an incoming tide, which is good, but we've got that sou'easter, uh, southerly sou'easter coming through, so it's wind against tide. And it pretty much uh, disheartens you, and you can't be bothered. And we spiral into fishing a depression. So I we'll might try and do some bits and pieces, but it might uh, just be a bit of a deck cam and a, a quick, uh, quick video on this one. Hopefully, some fish turn up. We're in our old, uh, old favourite spot, and this spot has produced uh, some massive snapper in the past. Fingers crossed today, it will do the same. There's quite a lot of prizes though. There's the average snapper, second average snapper, third average snapper, bigger snapper. So to get a couple would be good. We, we re usually run a few lines, but we can only run one at the moment because we're sort of swinging so much. So once that wind dies off, probably around 8.39 and the change of the tide, everything might line up. But what's time bite, what's bite time? 10 is it? 10 or 11? Yeah, we're probably just going to stick it out here actually. For the day, I don't think we're going to move unless uh, we get plagued with sharks or uh, or cooter. But so far it's pretty good. Usually we'd be um, plagued by sharks by now, I agree. Yeah. And we've only, uh, and Barty got that little hammer and dropped that other fish, so if the sharks were here in full force, we'd be hooking up every drop. Any other we just want the tide to turn now. What time is the tide meeting town? Well, I think eight o'clock is the change. Yeah, that's hard out. Oh well. Oh shit. You've got the motor too. No, I don't. I've got nothing. Like half an hour after the tide. I gotta go, I gotta go buddy, I gotta go, I gotta go. What the f I don't know. Can you get that yep, boy yep, out? Yep. Dude, this might be a snapper. Never mind, mate. Did you clear out that side? Yep. There's nothing in the water. Oh shit. <laughs> I hope it is. If, it, if it's a snapper, it's a good one. Yeah. <laughs> Fishing with your fucking row with it. But it just wasn't taking any line really well. Right? 
Oh, it's got a little bit of a knot to it. Doesn't it? Right out that side, dude. Yeah. It's got a little current. Which makes me think it's a snapper. It's just holding there, though, isn't it? Yeah, that's snappery. Yeah. Don't like it. I don't like it now. Well, I've got to get round that side, mate. I can't get it in. Get round there, Barty. If you go, we well, can go round if you want. You can't with all those rods. We just, uh, the snapper cup, we just landed a big snapper. It's uh, it's an absolute horse. Um, I think we've got the deck cam on it. I think the deck cam was running. He's uh, is a really big snapper. We'll check it out. Holy crap, buddy. What's he in there? He's, he's 20. Easy and some. Nice work. <coughs> Right, right. Get that in there, and I'm getting the rod back in the water. Old favourite spots paid off, guys. That was a strange fight, man. It wasn't a day. Jesus, that was weird. Is that gonna be? Is that gonna be one of uh, one of our better fish? Oh, mate, I don't know. But it's not bad. That was the rod that was just right on the, under the boat, wasn't it? Yeah. Dolging himself. Weird. That was weird as well. I like it though. I like it too. Really? I like it very much. I just never I never like getting my hopes up as I know. Well you've got my hopes like, down. I was quite confident. And then I see it, I was like, fuck it's a snap. He just kept saying it was a sharp, but it had the head the big head nods, eh? It did. It did have the big head nods, but it's just a strange that. It just hit at the back, eh? Hey? Like, it wasn't really doing anything, were we? And then he just sort of took off your way. That's a good fish, man. Well, that is a pretty cracker start to the day. I'll change the camera around so you can get a better look at him. But, a bit more than expected for the first fish. There you go guys. 
black magic snapper snack did the damage for the um, snapper cup of Nelson. Uh, this guy is, I'm not sure, we'll give him a, a measure in a way, but I'd easily say he's probably around that, oh, maybe 22 pounds, maybe about 22 pounds, but he is a giant, and that's our first fish after a pretty horrific, horrible start with wind against tide, uh, a bit of, uh, still a bit of old sickness from the week from up north, but to turn him up is the first fish. That is, uh, me and Barty are pretty stoked actually. He's a monster. And I'll measure him now, just over 80, centi 80 centimetres long. Yeah. So that's it there guys. Black Magic, Pinky, Snapper Snack. Did the damage. Once again, thank you Black Magic. Awesome rigs. Shark, buddy, see it. See the shark. It's just past after eight o'clock. Uh, we got that good fish. We're waiting for the tide to change now. Uh, we're pretty happy about that fish, to be fair. Um, Tides, the winds died off from the southeast now, so hopefully that nor nor'easter won't pick up until well after. We get at least two hours in the outgoing tide. Two hours after high uh, on the outgoing will be uh, bite time. But I'm just going to drop down. There's heaps of liveys around, so I'm going to drop down a little black magic uh, sabiki and see if we can't get some uh, some live baits. We, what are we going to do? We might cast some sort of half dead liveys right out the back on the straight line. Or drop them overboard but at the moment we're still just swinging and we notice not a lot of breeze but it's just enough to be torturous so black magic sabiki size 7 pink shrimp the old soft bait or fast clips these things are awesome for just quickly clipping on any of your rigs I'm using them on my slow jigs I use them for uh, sabikis like that and I'm using them for our black magic flashes as well our black magic stray lines all that stuff we'll just use that little fast clip there and that will clip stuff on easy and no problems if you want to change something out they're pretty cheap too they're like maybe five or six bucks for like 20 odd of them right let's see what bait fish are there, Barty? Should be some bait. Just the bait on there? Nah. No. No, no bait. I'll go freelance to start. And then, uh, if I have no luck on this, I'll go bait then. Yep, then straight away. Look at that. <laughs> oh, whoa, holy smokes. What have I got? Oh, drop D. Holy smack, see it's feisty. Straight on the bottom, no bait. The other beauty of the black magic sabiki, straight in. I'll leave it down and try and get a couple more. Oh, yep, yep. <laughs> Holy <Snapper>. smokes. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Bill, oh. oh. Did you reckon you just hooked a snap? Oh, probably. I need to loosen your drag off. <laughs> oh, got it! What in God's name? Look, straight out the bottom hook. Yeah, snaps. Definitely snap. Holy. Anyway, what I was saying, the Black Magic Sabikis uh, come with only four hooks, so that does. Uh, it's not a nightmare like the six hook rigs, and it only um, and it comes with a sinker as well, which makes life easy. Mistakenly, I didn't like letting off the drag on that uh, on that fish, and that was a good fish. <laughs> Maybe we just fish the beakies, do. <laughs> Whoa! Holy smokes! Oh, Mackie! Is it? Yeah. Really? Look at him. Jesus. Okay, so we can't handle them with our hands. Do we want to? Oh, look at them all. Oh, foul hook. Look at him. 
Yeah, just tell them. There you go. Little Mackie. Right, well these Mackies, we're going to try a Black Magic John Dory rig and hopefully get a snapper or possibly a John Dory. There's heaps of bait fish around which is unheard of here really for us here, isn't it mate? But, yeah, should be. But Black Magic gear man, it's awesome. Been using it for so long and I believe in it so much. Uh, it's done us good in the past and as you've seen by that snapper, that's one of their new uh, snapper snacks. Barty slaying the livey, so I'll get this guy rigged up. We'll put a livey on. Fingers crossed, something will come along and dominate it. I think there's king kingies are in the competition as well, so. Here's another good cracker. What do you say? Oh, yeah. Oh shit, you got another hook up. Where? On the top rod, your straight line. Oh really? Yep, that's hooked up too. Oh, just let him run, here we got these hooks. Okay, we just got a double hook up guys. I'm trying to get the lines in out the way, Farty's in. What, are you, how are you going? Are you ready for the other one? Yeah, I'll... Uh, Yep, I think so. Alright. I'll bring these in now, eh? Yep. He's gone hard, man. Is he? He's gone. He's snapped the rod. What? The top one. Do you want me to get the top one? Yeah, you want me. Oh, oh, just hook him. He's hooked. How's the other rod? Yeah, it's annoying. Oh, shit. This is a good fish. Okay, I'm going to leave him because that's yours. I'll grab him. Get him out the way. I don't think it's a monster, but it's a snapper. This guy's just sitting here more right. <laughs> but he's a um he's a big fish. He might not even be a snapper. It definitely is, is it? Yep. That's a snapper, mate. Net ready. I'll play fish to a bit for you. Yep. Lead it, lead it. Yeah, definitely a good, that's a good snapper on there. Holy shit. Lead it, lead it. Just a little one. Is it? It's not that little. <laughs> oh. Oh. Okay, I got him. Are those rods all right? Or you want me to get them out of the way? Yeah, they might be a little bit annoying. I'll get him out the net. I guess he's done all the hard work already. He's been on there a while, dude. He's well, he was going hard when I had him. Move him in the middle, mate. Just move in the middle, buddy. They hit almost identical times, man. Yeah, that's crazy, yeah. They're out in the back in the burley now. That's a, that's going to be a good fish, man. I was struggling to hold the bloody rod. I was trying to put it in the holder. Barty's on board. Oh, yeah, that's a good fish, man. That's your 20, buddy. <laughs> nice. Holy smokes. <sighs> <Bro. laughs> oh, buddy just got a big snapper. Uh, we'll get a. Uh, it's easily going to be a probably around a twenty, around a twenty pounder at least. Anyway, I'd say. That was one of the fish from the double hookup. It's the ripper. It's not a bad fish, dude. What is she? Probably 12, 13 pounds, I think. Yeah, somewhere in there. So there we go. Um, that was on the Snap Snack too, actually. What was, um, that, was it? Um, it was the the red and yellow one. Oh, um, Snapper Classic. Snapper Classic. That's the one. 
Snapper Classic, very nice snapper, probably around 21 pound I'd say. Um, yeah, we're having an absolute ball out here today. It's all win. Now. <laughs> Don't put that pressure on me. <laughs> Barty's just got a snapper or something hit his, hit, his, uh, hit his stray line. He's just free spooling it at the moment. He's taking line out and he just asked me if when to strike. I'm not telling him that. He loses it. Oh, he struck too early. Lost it. I just said that. <laughs> what happened? He just know. drop it. Must have been. What are you running bait on that? Are you using the Megla Pilly? Yeah, it's quite big. Not the one, not the big ones I've got out especially for you. Those ones? Yeah. Don't lie, the pack's not even open. Oh. Oh, oh great. That's what it was, he was playing my line. Oh, it's yours. Brilliant. Yeah, false alarm. Don't have dropped. Yeah, have you dropped it? <gasps> stop it! Stop! 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 You dropped that. How? How did that not pick up? Far oh, out. Oh, that's shit. Where's that? He'll leave it here, man. He'll come back, eh? Got it. That's like the best run of the day. <laughs> Holy crap! It's a problem with just one hop through the top, eh? Jesus. Really? Just drop that one. That was a good run. All right, well, that was a pretty good trip for me and Barty. We just cleaned up the boat now. Uh, the time is 12.13, uh, and that's us done uh, for this um, this vlog. Oh, actually, it wasn't meant to be a vlog. We just decided I'd start filming, and I'm glad I did, because we got some cracker snapper, and they're all pretty, um, they're all pretty good size. We're gonna head in now, uh, clean up the boat, uh, sort our shit out, and then um, go to prize giving this afternoon. But to be fair, that's a pretty fluky uh, trip to get two fish well over 20 pounds, and the other two are about 12, or 12, 14, were Yeah, 12, 14, I reckon, yep. So, uh, we're pretty happy about that. How can you not be, to be fair? So we'll see what, what else is caught. From what we've heard, uh, we haven't heard a lot actually. There's nothing going on on the radio, on Channel 8 or anything. So um, a couple of friends of ours haven't caught anything. It'll be interesting at prize giving. You know that's always the telltale story. Most people keep it secret. And to be fair, we've kept it pretty secret this trip. Right, well, we're gonna end it there. I actually might go to take the camera to prize giving maybe. Film a bit of that. It's a good idea. Well, probably not actually. We're definitely going to have a celebratory, uh, have a beer for uh, a celebration, cele celebratory, cele celebration beer. Because uh, I could not be happier. That's a wicked outcome. But I'll stop blabbering on, and uh, we'll see you at the prize giving, or we'll see you next time.